Um, well, it's, it's a Roman bowl. Um, it's almost 2,000 years old. Um, it's made of something called this bright red pottery. It's called oh, yeah. Samian ware. Yeah. Um, and it's made in France. Mm. Um, and it's transported to England in Roman times. Um, if you could afford it, if you're in Roman times, this is the best pottery to have. If, you can, if you've got the money, this is like Granny's Best China or like, like Royal Dalton or something. This is the, you know, the bee's knees. And if they made this, as I say, in France and exported it everywhere in the Roman Empire. So you can find pottery like this everywhere from sort of <coughs> Hadrian's Wall all the way through mm. kind of France, Greece, Italy, all the way down to Syria and Egypt. You find the same sort of pottery because if you were rich, this is what you bought. And one of the things that's really nice about this pot particularly is you can see these little pieces of lead Oh, yeah. Little metal bits. Well, these are rivets, and basically what's happened is somebody's dropped the pot and Oops. smashed, exactly, and it's so valuable that they've decided to try and repair it. And, of course, they don't have super glue or anything what, oh, like okay. we'd use now. They've used little bits of lead, so they've melted, they've cut little holes in it, and they've melted lead and poured it in to act like glue. And then they've obviously lost a bit because there's a bit missing here. Oh, yeah. And this is a whole lump. If you feel the weight of that... Oh God, it is heavy. Yeah, <laughs> it's a whole <laughs> lump of lead. Um, and obviously we know now lead is poisonous. Yeah. Romans didn't know that. No. So having a lead food bowl <laughs> was not very safe, but they didn't know that. Um, no. So they've repaired it with a big piece of lead. But uh, it just shows them there's an awful lot of effort to repair it. And now, yeah. if you drop a plate now, what do you do? Chuck it in the bin if you smash yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> they thought it was worth going to all this effort to repair it. So uh, it's a lovely little thing. It comes from Wavendon, that one.